what's up guys this is Matt Sword and we're playing GTA 5 so I I record this video because there is an update on GTA 5 that gives you an opportunity to buy a yacht and <laughs> and it will make you a VIP that you know it leads other missions and and it gives you other missions and and stuff that you can earn money from anyways so I want to check out the yacht first let me just go to the internet right here yacht should be on the dock site and you should click the picture over here that that you know that says galaxy super yachts and as you can see there's a there's a button right here create your own super yacht now as you guys can see I don't have any money to buy these yachts but I'm just here to show you what kind of yachts there are. There are three kinds of yachts. There is the Orion, the Pisces, the Aquaria, Aquarius. There you go. Um, to be honest, I think the interior of every every um, every yacht is all the same. The only difference is the exterior of the yacht. So as you can see, the exterior of that one is pretty cool. This one's a little bigger because there's two helipads. And yeah, this one's my favorite though, Aquarius. Just because of thi this feature on the jacuzzi part. Where was it? Um, there you go, jacuzzi. It has this things on the side, the, the shelter things that, you know, it's pretty nice to chill down here over here on the... On the um, thingamajigs anyways so let me just give you a tour of what's inside probably and uh, not probably this is what's inside so this is a lounge area oh no no this is the the bar area this is the hallways that's the outside of it is the front uh, you can actually lean on the rails so you can you can do the titanic scene over there uh, so many possibilities um, if you want to record a video and by the way for the Aquarius it it includes six water vehicles compared to the Orion it only includes two water vehicles and the Pisces only got four water vehicles so yeah basically the Aquarius is more expensive just because it's it's more it's it looks nice outside Plus, you have um, six more water vehicles. Um, the interior is pretty much the same. And let me just give you a tour here. Um, that's the back. That's the that's inside the bedroom. That's the bed. There is three beds, by the way, inside the um, Aquarius. I haven't. I don't know what the Orion has, and I don't know what the Pisces has. But there is three bedrooms on the Aquarius and the, the master's bedroom should be on the on the last side to uh, towards the towards the towards the towards the front so this is the bar area and this is the the, the lobby area which there's a big ass TV uh, pretty nice um, I love the jacuzzi that's my favorite that's my favorite spot over there. I love the bar area as well. It's also my favorite. And my last favorite is this. The end. Because you can do the Titanic scene. Anyways, that's about it for the yacht. Oh, no, no. There's more. You can customize it. So, let's say we choose Aquarius. It's worth $8 million in GTA money. So, there's chrome fittings. And there's gold fittings. We're basically uh, for me to be honest. I'm gonna go for the gold fittings. I think it looks fantastic. And there's two kinds of lightings. There's presidential and vivacious. There's green, blue, pink, and yellow. On on the presidential, there's one in vivacious, which I really love because it's like underglow neons for your car. But it's on your um, yacht. So it's pretty nice. There's green, blue, which is my favorite, pink, and yellow. I love the blue, so I'm going to choose a blue. It looks nice. So there's going to be 4, 8, 12. 
16, 16 colors for the yacht you can choose. There's this one, there's Pacific, Nautical, Mariner, Merchant, Pristine, Azure, Uniform, Ruby. Mediterranean, Vintage, Continental, Battleship, oh cool, Voyager, in Interpid, Classico, and Command. So I love, I love, um, I like, um, how many colors? I like three colors. These and this. This one reminds me of vault -Tec. Uh, remember the, the yellow stripes and blue? That's why I like it. And this one just looks like um, a freaking battleship. Like it's a freaking um, it's a freaking battleship basically. I love it. It's it's so cool. So I'm just gonna choose this one, which is my. I have three favorites, so I'm I'm like. Oh, oh, uh, I'll choose this one because I've been playing so much Fall Fallout 4. Anyway, so we're gonna choose different flags here. Sadly, there is no Philippine flag, which I am. I am um, a Filipino. And although I'm living in America, but I'm kind of tired of looking at the American flag all the time. It's these American all the flags. So we're gonna gonna put um, Sweden, Sweden, uh, Sverige, as my cousins live there. So we're gonna name it Matt Sword, or better yet. Ah, gives me a good idea. Met. Anik. Anik. Yeah. You see what I did there? It's Titanic, but it's not Titanic. It's Metanic. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to put next. And all in all, if you chose what I chose, the more the, the expensive ones, Basically, you're gonna end up with this amount nine million nine hundred ten thousand um, dollars, which is basically a um, hundred dollars, like a hundred, hundred twelve dollars, probably was it? Um, not sure, but it's a hundred dollars. Uh, yeah. So if I put by now. It says alert insufficient funds. Um, I'm gonna put cancel because I don't have money for that, sadly. So the thing is, just in case you buy the yacht, it will give you chance to be uh, VIP, which gives you new missions, new opportunities to go to be a different person, to be a VIP basically. To be there's so many things on VIP. I wish I could cover it. For you guys but sadly I cannot because I don't have the funds for that so we're gonna go for uh, and look for the new cars we basically have one three six nine new cars on the on the legendary which is the only cars that are new so there we have um, this one in Ponte nightshade we have bravado Ver Verlier, Verlier, we have De Class Mamba, Enes Cognos. Anyways, you guys could read it. Um, I'm not really interested with these last six cars. I'm more interested on these three. Although I'm just too, I'm just so interested on these two. This one first and foremost because I love vintage cars. Cars that that um that started on 40s and the 50s and this car looks so much from the 40s and 50s i love it so much and this one though this one if you know how to customize and tweak your cars very nicely you could actually make this look like a batmobile like the old school batmobile with the like you know the long nose batmobile 
so yeah that's pretty cool so um let's go to warstock and as you can see there is this new limo that has that has a minigun on top of it <laughs> it's it's a uh, armored so basically you could try shooting this it won't do anything to it um you shoot um an rpg on it it won't blow up right away it would just um shatter the glass the the bulletproof glasses um it basically takes two rpg shots to basically blow this up so it's pretty solid i love it i love the luxury and and the badassery on this car it's so awesome i love the combination um yeah that's basically it for the vehicles and now let's go to the hmm. let's go to the let's go to the pro properties that is new. There is three custom apartments right here. They're all in the Eclipse Towers, but they they cost differently. They cost this one cost one million and a hundred thousand. This one is nine hundred eighty-five thousand. This one is nine hundred five thousand. Okay, basically, when you custom these guys. Um, they have the same customization. They have the same look. Uh, different, different. Um, I mean, they're different on on the prices, but they have the same look. They have the same modern, moody, vibrant, sharp, monochrome, seductive, regal, and aqua. They all look the same for those three. The difference is the level. Of the tower which you're, you're which you're gonna buy the the room at so if you buy the room at the highest part of the tower is basically gonna be, it it's basically gonna be expensive because of the ambience it, it it'll show you and if you buy this one it's basically probably gonna be in the middle and this one's probably gonna be at at um, the lowest part but not that lowest not the lowest um, not that low I mean so um I haven't seen these other two, but I've seen this one. This one on top. This is pretty nice. You can see everything. Um, so basically, let me show you the um, the customization. Modern. I like the modern. It's simple. I like it. Moody. I like the moody as well. It's kind of, you know, it's got some spunk in there, you know. Vibrant. Oh, vibrant. I love vibrant. It just reminds me of Fallout 4, the pre-war fallout 4 you know when you started fallout 4 and then everything's colorful green orange yeah it's like that it's kind of that kind of vibe and there's a sharp one sophisticated and um this monochrome oh I, this is my favorite guys i love modern designs of houses and i love this one it's very spacious very clear and bright and it's kind of dark but I mean when it's nighttime it lights up so it's 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 still a good thing I mean I love the color black and white so that's why I choose that most and this one is just super red um, it's kind of for me myself it's kind of sore of the eyes I mean I just can't live in too much red especially I want to de-stress after work after days of work so I would choose the monochrome this one's pretty nice, pretty mellow. I like the va va lavender color. It gives me um, a strange vibe of the lavender smell, you know? If there's an air freshener there that's lavender, it's perfect. Aqua, now aqua makes gives me an idea of that there's a swimming pool over there on the other side. But I don't think there is though. But I wish there was. It would be so cool. It would be a so it would be an awesome idea to have a swimming pool over there. And yeah, that would be so awesome. By the way, um, I've seen um, I've seen modern. I've seen I've seen this design. Was it was it vibrant, sharp? Yeah, I, I've seen this design, and this design has I pro they probably have two floors. It's kind of like a loft kind of thing, you know, where there's a little little um, leveling in in the apartment that you go up and that the. Um, the, the the level on the top is gonna be your bedroom and all sorts of stuff um, yeah so basically that's the apartments and we have tons of housing as well we have the stilt housings so we have one two 
three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight stilt apartments, stilt housings. So, so basically, these guys are on the side of the mountain. Um, this one is the most expensive one, which I like because it's like a private, private thing. Unlike these things, you have it. It looks like you have to share it with other people. And yeah, I haven't seen these things yet. So yeah, it's for you guys to find out what these guys looks like. Let me see if there's like a picture in there. No, I don't think so. So yeah, this guy, this thing right here is my favorite. Um, let's go over here. Get directions. Go over there. Let's go really quick. Oh, before we be oh shoot my car. Ah. Before we go over there, let's stop by the gun shop and I'll show you the two new weapons that 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 is included with the update. And one is melee and one is ranged. Jesus, you're not really a big gun um not really a big gun um <sighs> fan, but care. These things are pretty cool. There's a switchblade, which I'm gonna show you right now. Uh, they're right here. There it is. A switchblade. Which, see? It's pretty cool. And there's so many things. You can customize this to different, different things. There's a golden switchblade, whatever. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. There's this gun right here, which is pretty cool also. Ah, not that one. Ah. All right, this one, it's called the heavy revolver. It's it's pretty tight. I mean, is there any other revolvers in this game? Um, let me see. Revolvers. Revol I think there are revolvers in this game. I think there are other revolvers in this game aside from that, but for now, I think that's the only thing I can see. I guess I'm not sure. It's been a while since I played GTA 5. So, yeah. A revolver, guys. It's pretty cool. Looks pretty nice and decent. I love revolvers. When it comes to guns, I love revolvers compared to other um, handguns. Although, I would I would definitely, you know, just... Oh, this one's nice. This one's a small gun. This is a women's pistol. Um, well, that was a stereotype back then. I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of messed up. Anyways. So yeah, I like this gun. I love revolvers. That's the that's the best gun I, I want. When I'm looking for a, a nerf gun, I always look for a, a, a revolver nerf gun. Until now, I can't find one. Except for the zombie ones. Have a nice one. Anyway, so that's it for the new guns. The new gun update. And yeah. And there's probably a new camo. Was it a new camo? There's a new camo, was it? Um, right here. No. Uh, business casual smart no there's a new camo I've heard there was a new camo I haven't seen it uh, luxury uh, no 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 guys this this guy right here reminds me of um, uh, <laughs> not inspector gadget um, who's that synth again on Fallout 4 forgot his name oh Valentine. Yeah, this is Nick Valentine right here, guys. <laughs> Anyways. So yeah, um, the new camo is for you guys to find out. Because I don't have the money to buy it and show it to you guys. Sadly, I can't. But yeah, let's move on and I'll show you the apartment over to the other side. The most expensive one that I want to buy. Let's go over there really quick.
Ha! Badass parking. <laughs> we got so many scratches. It's okay, we get free repair from the from when we park on the garage. Anyways, this is the apartment on sale. It looks like it's only for you. That's why I like it. It has a, a, a separate entrance. Anyways. So yeah, this is the one for sale. And it's very expensive. It's $800,000 on GTA money. So yeah, we're just going to look over here. Oh, nice view, by the way. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Jump. Okay. So we got a pool right here. I think this was w the one on the trailer. I think this was the one on the trailer. Yeah. Huh. Or that one right there. Oh, I like that one too. Oh my gosh. Is that one for sale? Wait a minute. Let me check. Huh. Is that one for sale? Is that one for... Wait a minute. Oh! No! Oh! There you go. Okay. Okay. Can I make it? One, two, three! Huh! Oh, shit! <laughs> Okay, anyways, we can go over here. Okay, is this one for sale? Is it or is it not? Oh my gosh, sadly it's not. Oh my goodness, I love this one though. I'd prefer this one more than the other one. Oh my gosh, look at the pool area. It's so beautiful. Why can't this be for sale? Why can't this be the one for sale? Oh my gosh, look at this beautiful thing. There's even uh there's even an umbrella down here. Oh my goodness. Uh, uh, I guess the apartments are better. Then cause look at this. This is beautiful. How can this be not for sale? Oh my gosh. Look at that. Look at the view down there too. I mean the view isn't that good, isn't that great. But still, I like the pool area. I like I like pool areas. I like I like I like big pool areas. I like big things. Anyways, this one's the most expensive one. You've got a little pool right here. It's the one the pool over there is bigger than this one. Boom! Uh, Geronimo! <laughs> yeah. Let's let's make a big splash here, guys. Huh! Boom! That's funny. Alright. So yeah. This is pretty much it. The $800,000 um, house or an apartment. Yeah, this is basically it, guys. Um, I haven't seen the interior. So it's pretty much too early to judge on my side. But on my perspective, I like the other one better. The other one is so much better. I mean, for me at least. That is my judgment. So, it depends on you guys, on what you guys want. Um, is there anything I forgot to tell you guys about the new update? Um, if there any, if there's anything else I forgot to tell you guys about the new update, please put, the, put your comments below. And make sure to leave a like. And thank you for watching. Please make sure to subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet. And I'll see you on my next video. Thank you guys for watching. Oh, by the way, and if you guys want to watch more of these GTA 5 um, videos, just put some comments below. Please. Please. Oh, by the way, I just want to tell you guys that I, ha I am planning to make two more, two more series of... Um, on my YouTube channel it's gonna be one for the Fallout 4 and one for GTA 5 the GTA 5 one is gonna be about this guy that that is that is basically homeless and he's got no no money at all like zero money and he's trying to make it he's trying to make it on the social ladder he's trying to be rich that's his ultimate mission to be rich so yeah, guys, um, tune in on that. Maybe you'll be, you know, a part of my life, of this guy's life, I mean, um, on on his mission to be rich. <laughs> and yeah, on Fallout 4 as well, the, that, that one would be about settlements, about settlement creations. It's either 
modded or not modded i'm planning to i'm planning to um customize all the settlements there is in fallout 4 and both modded and unmodded so yeah m please make sure to um stay tuned to that as well thank you guys for watching and as always i'll see you on my next video thank you for watching